Welcome to Cat Night TV, everyone. I am Cat. We are going to be playing Minecraft Story Mode, The Silent Type, Part 2. In this playthrough, I am not only making the characters' choices more of the silent type, but I am also not doing a whole lot of commentary. So enjoy the playthrough. So, when we're making the deal, I need you to let me do the talking, okay? I just don't want anything to screw this up. Or anyone. Yeah, what you're doing right now is pretty much perfect. Jesse. And Petra? Hey, you all know Petra, my new super close friend. We're super close now. We ran into each other while I was looking for Reuben. Poor Reuben. What happened to his eye? We had a little run-in with some zombies. They whacked him good. But Reuben held his own. What were you doing in the woods, Petra? Nothing. Just drawn by the sound of Jesse's high-pitched screams. I would have been spider bait if she hadn't have found me. Sorry we didn't come with you, Jesse. But hey, we won! Looks like abandoning friends and their time of need paid off yet again. If I didn't know any better, I'd think that creeper was really gonna explode. We did okay, didn't we? I still wish I'd gotten that part in the back to look better. I could have fit more fireworks in there, somewhere. On second thought, this thing is perfect. Hey, Jesse, it's time to go see about that thing. Oh, right. The thing. Subtle. Yeah? As a punch to the face. Axel and I were gonna head into Endercon anyway. See you in there? I heard somebody saying there's free cake by the map booth. Hurry. We're supposed to meet in the alley over there. Dark. Dark. Very dark in here. That's weird. He said the dark, creepy alley close to the gates, but he's not here. Maybe he's late. Are you sure this is the dark, creepy alley he meant? Hmm. I was. Okay, new plan. You stay here, just in case this is the spot he meant, and I'll look around. I guess I could have heard him wrong. Then again, I've never gotten a meetup spot wrong before. But then why would he be late? I'll be back before you know it. If he shows up while I'm gone, just stall for me. And just who are you? I'm waiting. Answer me. I'm supposed to meet with Petra, not whatever you're supposed to be. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't walk out of here right now. Well, I'm a very busy man. She didn't mention anything about a partner. Do you have the skull? Uh, well... You do or you don't? You'd better not be toying with me. Unacceptable. I'm not wasting any more time with you. Ivor! Not a moment too soon. Your partner here almost soured the deal. Ah, oh, well, that's not good. I left my friend Jesse here while I went looking for you. I've got what you ask for. If you have what you promised us. You didn't say anything about an us when we first met? And I don't like surprises. If these are the sorts of people you associate with, perhaps we should call the whole thing off. My friend is fine, right, Jesse? There's no problem here. Let's not be too hasty, okay? This is just a little misunderstanding. Looks like we're good to go. Proceed, then. I'll take that diamond now. Take it. You've earned it. Uh, this isn't 
isn't a diamond. No, it's lapis. Of all the dirty, underhanded tricks to pull. I can't believe that guy got one over on me. Screw this. We're going after him. I'm either getting that diamond, or I'm getting my skull back. Or you'll make him pay. Right? Right? Come on. Do you see him anywhere? We lost him. Then we'll just have to find him again. Go. We won't find him just standing around. There he is! Gabriel! Gabriel! Step aside, I have please. just one question. Hold all your questions until after the keynote. But the keynote sold out. Hold all your questions anyway. You guys big Gabriel fans or something? Too bad it's sold out. What's up? What's up? Nothing. What's up with you? Nothing. What's up with you? I just said, nothing. Hey, uh, congrats on the win. I mean, I still think our beacon was amazing, but you guys did a pretty good job, too. I mean, I thought the whole monster theme was plenty cool, but fireworks, too? It was sort of cool. Anyway, congratulations again. Hey, you didn't happen to see a creepy guy with long hair and a beard roaming around, did you? I don't think so. Why? He kind of scammed Petra out of a diamond earlier. Oh, everyone knows you don't mess with Petra. Not if you know what's good for you. I'll keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. I appreciate it. So, uh, we're cool? Yeah, we're cool. Cool, cool. <laughs> see you later, Lucas. Yeah, see ya. I'm looking for someone. Kinda tall, kinda mysterious. Hypnotic eyes and a devilish smile? Oh, no, no, not you. Not you. No, I'm looking for a creepy guy with a beard. <laughs> Thought you could just wiggle right out of that trap, didn't you? Well, wiggle as much as you want. You're not going anywhere. Axel, listen up. Any chance you've seen a creepy-looking beardy guy anywhere? No. Petra told me what happened. I'm keeping an eye out for him. Okay, so I got a little distracted. It's just this machine presses all my buttons. Unnecessarily complicated, mean to birds for no reason. It's just, when something like this calls, you gotta answer. But I swear, as soon as the demonstration is over, Petra did make it sound kind of serious. The old silent treatment, huh? All right, all right, I'll look. After I watch one more chicken get owned, I see you now, weirdo. Well, if it isn't Team Trash Bag, that was your stupid pig. I hear intense heat causes brain damage. It does boost the flavor something crazy, though. Nice comeback, jerkwad. Hey! You're... What do you think you're doing? Oh, I'm sorry. Get away from me! I said I was sorry. <laughs> Ruben? Where'd you wander off to? Get your pork chops here. Fresh off the boat. 
Nothing sticks to your ribs quite like a juicy pork chop. Ruben! What's the big idea? I'm trying to run a business here. That's my pig. You kidnapped my pig. Well, I don't know what you're talking about, Chief. I found this pig wandering alone in the street. Not the fattest pig I've ever seen. But he should cook up real nice anyway. I might be amenable to some kind of trade. Not that you look like you got much of value. <laughs> I gotta get some kind of return on my investment. Otherwise, it's straight to the slaughterhouse for this one. Ooh. Ow. Ow. I'm sorry, Reuben. I was so busy trying to find that creepy dude, I didn't notice. Remember that thing I had to go do with Petra? Long story short, we met up with this guy. He cheated me and Petra on a deal, and now we're trying to track him down. You in? Oh, I'm in, all right. Any sign of him? I thought I saw him earlier, but it was just a false alarm. Wait! There he is! Looks like he's heading towards the hall. We're gonna have to get past that usher to follow him. Let's go! So... yeah. Hey, what would it take to get us inside tonight? Uh, tickets? <laughs> that was a good one. You should laugh. I'm sorry, but no tickets, no show. Chicken! 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 It's gone. You're totally fine. You're a totally cool dude. We have to do something. Like what? This show has been sold out for ages. I could bust right through. I just need a little wind-up room. Any other bright ideas? A lot of chickens running around might be a distraction. Shoot, shoot! Get out of here! The usher is afraid of chickens. What would you say if I told you I want to break this guy's chicken machine? To create the mother of all distractions. But you have to break that pane of glass. How are you going to reach it? Let's look around. There has to be something we can do. I need to reach that window, but the fence is in the way. And I don't think I can mess up the fence if he's around. I could reach that glass with a slime block. Oh, hey! We meet again! <laughs> One slime block, please. We don't give out slime blocks here, just slime balls. We've got a limited supply today, and we're only giving out two per customer. You could craft your own slime block if you had nine slime balls. Ugh, whatever. A round of slime balls for everyone, please. Wait, this is only eight slime balls. We need one more to make a block. Okay, we need to find another way to get some more slime, and quick. On it. One more slime ball, please. I'm afraid not. If I break the rules for you, then I have to break them for everybody, and then I'll be out of slime completely. Sorry. 
come on, please? I've got to find one more slime ball. Ruben, I need your guidance. What would you do in a situation like this? I hear you, brother. Hey, uh, Lucas. Can you do me a favor? Anything's possible. I need slime balls. I swear I have a really good explanation. Whatever you guys are doing, count me in. Thanks, Lucas. Told you he was useful. Oh man, this guy isn't actually cool, is he? Remains to be seen. It's crafting time. So, you guys have been building together long? You've got good chemistry. Are you jealous? I'm just saying, I think it's cool you have a team that works so well together. You're totally jealous. How's it going, Jesse? Ta-da! One slime block. Gross. I'll take that. Right there. It's all you, Jesse. Give me a boost. Ugh. Two.